Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. I'm Derek Ray, here on the commentary position, joined by Lee Dixon to help me describe all the action. And the focus is on live action from Ligue 1. It's Olympic Marseille, and they face Racing Club de Lens. Yeah, thank you, Derek. Always my favourite time of the week, spending time with you at games. We should be in for a belter here with these two. And here's how it looks for Marseille. Steve Mondonda stands between the posts. Valentin Rongier plays with Kevin Strootman in the centre of midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. The starting lineup for Racing Club de Lens. Interesting setup. It looks like 5 4 1, but flexibility part of the equation, Lee. Well, this system gives real freedom for one or two of those midfield players to get forward and support the lone striker and make runs into the box. It'll be more like a three at the back, full backs pushing high and wide. It's a good system as long as those full backs know their roles. Radonjic. Amavi. Valentin Rongier. And Bednarek, Strootman, Radonjic, Jordan Amavi with it. Happy to take on the shot. Terrific block there. Just a bit too high with that powerful effort. Yeah, he's just leaned back, Derek. Power was there, but not the direction. Huang Inbiom, Gumni. Ayrton, Maurice, David, Gumni, Jonathan David, playing with purpose and control, it's got to be, and up for grabs off the keeper. Well, they've simply got to play better, they can't keep conceding chances at the back, they've dodged another one. The crowd are letting him know about it as well, urging them on to try and improve themselves. It's been pretty well impossible to escape all the news stories surrounding him ahead of today's match. And the rumours have been confirmed. He's elected to end his illustrious career at the end of this campaign. A massive loss for the club league. Yeah, it really is. Obviously, he's going to be missed very much here. He's a key player on the pitch and in the dressing room. No doubt they'll be looking at the transfer window ahead to try and strengthen and fill that gap he's going to leave. Good. And he's made headway. Surely that will give them quite the lift. An early opening goal lead. Well, you always want to start quickly, and there's just certainly a quick start there. What a finish. Well, in this replay, you're going to see a 2v1 against the keeper. How does that happen? He'll be asking his defence why he was left exposed. Nothing he could do. The opening goal of the game, then. Radonjic, Amavi, Valentin Rongier, Payet. Justova, Sacco with it. 
And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. And space for the cross. Not fantastic defending. Let's see if it helps the opposition. And deliver towards the back post. Fine goalkeeping to push that away. He's given it away. Stokeman. It's there for him. And the keeper taking care of the situation. David. Huang in beyond. Maurice. Ayrton. Huang in beyond. And let's join Alan McAnally because I believe there's been a goal in the Nantes game. Alan? It's a goal for Nantes. 27 minutes played. 1 0. Thank you, Alan McAnally. Strootman. Tova. It is a decent looking attack here. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. The visitors are struggling with possession, really. But again, we've seen it before. We'll see it again. Their counter attack play has been up. There's a slide draw pass. Textbook defending inside the box. Couldn't keep it. Ayrton. Huang in beyond. Gumni. Well, sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game. Delightful pass. But didn't quite do enough. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. And the keeper has custody of the ball, but just a few seconds beforehand, he had a big save to make. Well, keep hold of it. Have a breather, because that first save deserves us all to look at him and clap. Dimitri Payet with it. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Silva crossing. Well, far too much on that particular cross. Corner given. They favoured a short one here. Low trajectory ball there. Tremendous intuition to win it back. And he's going to be disappointed with that. Giving it a try. Competence from the keeper. Yeah, concentration for goalkeepers. He was spot on there. Going short. To the middle, courtesy of Payet. Still alive. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. David. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Nemanja Radonjic. An attack full of promise. Maneuvering his way forward. And that was a very fine read. Beautifully timed. Was in the right place to intercept. And the whistle is sounded for half time in this game. You've certainly got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Lee. Well, Derek, it certainly was a good 45 minutes from the lad. Obviously, got the goal to give him the lead, but he's looked very, very lively as well. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Maurice. David. Huang Inbiom. 
Jonathan David. Gumni. Will it be? Well, body in the way. Huang in beyond. Dangerous looking attack. Huang in beyond. Another game from Liga for you to look forward to on EA TV. It's Olympic Marseille facing Toulouse. Yeah, it's very easy to build a case for those two teams to make that game a real cracker. You should be tuned. Great opportunity. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. A league that's always technically very sound, Liga. And a game for you to look forward to on EA TV. It's Racing Club de Lens facing Monaco. Yeah, that looks a great matchup, doesn't it? Looking forward to some fast flowing football there. Will they profit from this situation? Has teammates waiting inside the area. And he did what he had to do defensively. And 30 minutes left for play in this match. Ayrton. He's had to go for it. Wins the ball. Well, they've won themselves a corner and a chance perhaps to add an additional goal for security. Taken short, cutting the ball back, wonderful block, and a powerful effort, but just lacking accuracy. Yeah, narrowly wide, Derek. Decent effort, he smashed it. Well, the visitors very much dictating the tempo over the last 15 minutes or so. They've created a lot from midfield. Their forwards are having a field day. Coach will be really happy with the creativity, but he'd be even happier if he can extend their lead now. Very happy indeed. Jordan Amavi with it. Valentin Rongier. Marseille couldn't maintain possession. Huang Inbiom. Well, he's given it away. Might be able to get in behind the defence. William Jose. Payet. Huang Inbiom. Gumni. Jonathan David. And news of a goal in the Mets match. Alan McAnally can tell us more. It's a goal for Mets. 75 minutes played. 1-1. One, one. Thank you, Alan McAnally. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw-in. Valentin Rongier. Kevin Strootman. Strootman. Radonjic. And very deftly cut out. A deft clearance.
Huang Inbiom. Pass after pass, happy to just keep possession and frustrate their opponents. Straight down the throat of the opposition. The players are using this energy from the crowd to drive them forward time after time to get back into this. Uh, the keeper completely untroubled. News of a goal on the PSG game. Alan McAnally has the details. It's a third goal for Paris Saint-Germain. It's been scored by Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Amazing little run past the defenders, followed by a powerful strike past the keeper. Nine minutes remain, 3-0. Thanks very much as always, Alan. Well, he got the touch on the ball, and so a corner it'll be. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. They've taken this corner short. De La Vague giving it a try. Well, he's lost it. And it's a case of just five minutes left. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Tomac might really be able to trouble them here. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. That's well blocked. Good tackle, it'll be a throw. And here is Willian Jose. Strootman. He has time to play it over. Marseille couldn't maintain possession. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. Valentin Rogier. Well, it's really important the players try and recognise this noise in the ground and use that to get an equaliser. Making sure nothing untoward happened. And now it is truly final. The match is over. Well, his performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Lee. Well, he's always a danger, isn't he? No more so when he grabbed that goal. He never disappoints me when I watch him. He's just too good, simple.